while. It's been a while, I guess. Um, I think it's been like four days or something. I don't know. So, so I'm making, oh yeah, I'm actually using a stick instead of my hand. Just trying something new, that's what. So, this is another DIY um, things we could do because why not? Because I'm pretty bored. And yeah, so today we'll make uh, miniature phones for LPS or small dolls. So let me just show you. Uh, let's see. You could use it like black and white. This is, this one right now I'm holding, it's a pink one. That's like a year, I think, whatever. It's in, This one I made like, I don't know when I made it, but it was today. If it could focus, okay, whatever. So that's the case. Anyway, you can make any kind of case. And so yeah, let's get started, shall we? But before we start, the items we need for the miniature phones is scissor, any kind of scissor, just using scissor, I guess. Tape or glue, but I don't have glue right now, so yeah. You need um, the paper you need as your case or whatever. For your case, you could either use a copy one or you can make your own like with glitter or something. More cases. And the actual phone. And then you will need cardboard to make it like harder. Like over here. So let's get started, shall we? Shall we? Yeah. My brothers, let's get started, shall we? Um, let's see. I'm just gonna put my LPS down, I guess. So as you copy or whatever you made your cake, uh, phone, first step is to cut it. Of course, you have to do it like slowly, I guess. If I could. So this, the other rest, don't trash it. You can still use it. So yeah. And take patient for you to actually cut it. Okay. In yeah. Just don't like actually cut the whole thing. Yeah. It doesn't need to be perfect, so yeah. Because you can like fix it later. So. so, this is what it came out. You just trim a little bit more if you need to. Not too much. Like I said, it doesn't need to be perfect. If it's your first try, you could like always try again. So now we have the two items, the two paper. You could make your own case or like copy it. So I have many cases I could choose from, like this flower cases. There's like a lot, like eight of them. Um, this aqua teal case or this uh, black and white glitter case. So for this um, item, I will choose the black one because yeah. And I will show you how to make your own case like with glitter later after this one. So yeah. Okay, let me just move out the other one that's not important. Don't lose your little paper or else you have to like redo it again. So yeah, just put it aside. And this one, if you didn't cut down or cut your case yet, you should do it right now. So that's what I'm doing. Okay, uh, let's see. Okay, that's what the phone looks like. So, as you see now, we have all three parts. Now you just, like, use the case and the back of the phone. Back of, uh, okay. Back of the phone 
and tape it or glue on the construction board. Yeah, so let's do it. Let's just move this. see as you see this is a board you take this two to tape it so you can get this amount of size and like roll it or something or fold it and it's this size you put it on top of your back of the phone tape it in the right size well, the case, the phone doesn't need to be in the right size since you could like trim it off some part of it. But make sure don't like actually ruin it. You can also make your phone uh, without a case since it doesn't really much matter. So here is the finish. Now just like trim a little bit. Your, if there's any white in it. So this is what it looks like right now. Now it looks really weird, but you can like, it's not gonna be weird after you're like finished with your product. So yeah. So just move the front uh, phone away for a little bit until you need it. And let's start like using the construction. So you put it over here or in the corner or whatever place, or I'm just gonna do here so it'd be easier. Tape it down and then you cut it. So let me just get my tape. The same size as you did last time. So yeah. You get your construction and do it. younger than a teenager, please ask your parents to cut it for you since it could be a little bit dangerous. So yeah, you could just take your time. Okay, this is what it looks like right now. As you can see, that's what it looks like. You could like trim it off. So that's what I'm gonna do. Now it's ready for the front. You just like tape it as a same step as always. And then cut it the axis. It doesn't look that bad, I guess, but it's the case. So if it's your first try, it's okay to mess up anyway because nobody's perfect. So that's one of the case. Now I shall show you the glitter one after I repeat the same step as putting the two back stuff together. So I am done with the repeating, so let me show you the phone that should look like. It should look like maybe this phone. So let's, so if you want a glitter phone that actually have glitter on, you should use Mod Podge, glitter, and a paintbrush. Let me just get one. Um, you yeah, just get a paintbrush, any kind if you like. I'm just going to use this paintbrush. 
Yeah. So, you will need paper to cover your table, so I'll be back. I'll be in the right now in the floor. Uh, let's, so, let's get started with putting Mod Podge on your paper or play whatever you're going to put your Mod Podge to actually make that glitter phone. So, yeah. So, you open your Mod Podge, any kind of Mod Podge you could use. Try to use a little bit since we're not trying to waste it. Yeah, that much. And any type of glitter you like with your phone case, I guess. So I guess you could just start after you open your glitter right here. So, okay, this paper is just not working. Let me just find that one. That will actually work. Like this one. Right here. Um, try to use, try to always put a lot of glitter and then put more Mod Podge to like conceal the glitter. you can actually do it now. You're like pretty far away. Okay, you're not. So I'm just looking at the screen. So, it she looks like this kind of case. It looks pretty cool though. Just dab more. Not to waste any glitter. This is like really cool like but you know whatever still make more glitter on it also use paint brush to put more mod podge it up so you should let it dry for a bit I guess so this is what the case looks like let me show you all the cases that I made in this DIY so this one is the glitter one. Kind of messed up, but it was an experiment, so yeah. Then this iPhone, other iPhone, and this other iPhone, and this, blah, blah, blah. So as you can see, you can make any kind you like. It doesn't need to be iPhones, but yeah. So thanks for watching this random video again, and yeah, see you next time. Bye.